Hey guys, uh, welcome to your uh, general reading. Uh, what karma are they currently facing for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs for July 2021? Uh, so we are going to take a look at the person that you're currently thinking about, what they, uh, what they recently did to you or in the past, and then we'll finish off the read to see what karma they're currently facing or will face moving forward. So keep in mind this could be... Um, you know, with anyone, uh, a partner, an ex, a friend, a family member, a co-worker, um, just apply this to your own unique situation. Um, and feel free to switch the roles if you want. The roles could be flipped or reverse. I mean, this could be karma that you're facing. So like I said, apply it to your own unique situation. Um, uh, before we get started, if you guys haven't done so yet, hit the subscription button and the notification bell so that you guys get alerts on new content that's being uploaded onto my channel. Uh, give this video a thumbs up so this video can circulate around to individuals that need to hear this. And uh, also, if you guys haven't noticed, I did turn off my uh, comment section in all my videos because lately I've been getting a lot of spam comments. Uh, it was getting hard to stay on top of it, reporting it, deleting it. So um, in the meantime, if you guys need to reach out to me in regards to a video that you watched, feel free to reach out to me on my Instagram handle. That is in the description box below. Just pop me a DM. Um, those of you that are interested in booking a private personal reading with me, the link is in the description box below. All right, let's get started. Tell me about the person that Cancer is thinking about. What did this person recently do to uh, Cancer or in the past? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for July 2021. What did this person do to Cancer recently or in the past? Wow, the Ten of Swords. There was definitely some betrayal here. You guys could have been married at one point. Yeah. Or this could be happening in a family situation. But let's see. All right, we have the Page of Swords. Libra, Aquarius, Gemini, Energy. The Six of Swords. The Empress, Libra, Taurus, Energy. The Two of Pentacles. The Seven of Swords and the Sun. Seems like maybe something was revealed here. There was lies and deception going on here. Someone could be, yeah, someone could have been a player, Knight of Wands, someone who was unstable, wasn't really traditional. So I feel like you could have been in a in a relationship with this person, but this person could have been all over the place. So I'm getting a younger energy, which I feel like it's this uh, page and this night, and we have an empress here. So like I said, place yourself where you see fit. Take it as it resonates. The roles could be flipped or reverse. Uh, yeah, keep in mind this could be karma that you're going through, uh, Cancer. So. All right, tell me about this Page of Swords here. What's going on with this Page of Swords? Tell me about the Page of Swords. All right, we have Judgment here, Sagittarius Energy. Tell me about the Six of Swords. The World, Capricorn Energy, or any of the fixed signs here. 
Alright, tell me about this Empress. Why is this Empress here? Ten of Wands. Tell me about the Ten of... No, the Two of Pentacles. You have the Fool here. Aries energies. Um, Aquarius energy. Why is the Seven of Swords here? You have the High Priestess. It looks like a secret was revealed here. Someone was hiding something. Yeah, we have the Unknown on the bottom of the deck. Someone's definitely hiding something. Someone here maybe made a bad judgment call, made poor decisions here. Uh, tell me about the sun. And the three of pentacles. We have the six of cups here. This could be an ex. This could be a past life soulmate here. Perhaps... Someone could have been hiding an ex here. Yeah, someone could be, someone could have been hiding an ex. <sighs> you know what? I feel like someone here reconciled with an ex here behind someone's back. Yeah, and that caused a major betrayal. There was uh, some uh, paranoia surrounding this, perhaps. Like maybe there was this uh, energy of knowing and I feel like it was this empress that knew. I feel like someone made a bad judgment call. Yeah, I do feel like there was someone here that perhaps acted. In a way that someone just didn't consider this other person's feelings here. This person could have been messaging this ex behind your back. This person also could have traveled to this person. Maybe they were telling you that, you know, they were on a business trip and they were meeting up with this person. All right, tell me what karma this person is currently facing or will face moving forward and the rest of eternity if this person doesn't change. Tell me about uh, Cancer's person. What karma are they currently facing or will face moving forward? Power, Aries, Scorpio energy, Three of Wands, Eight of Cups, The Magician, Gemini, Virgo energy, The Ten of Cups, The Ten of Wands, and The Eight of Wands here. I mean, there's going to be some perhaps unexpected communication from this person. Maybe you haven't heard from this person in a while. This could, this person could have gone back to an ex and started a new life with this person here too. Because I don't, I don't think you guys are together or anything like that. Yeah, because look at that. Let's see. Yeah, so... You have the Queen of Pentacles here, so I'm feeling like this is the, the X here. Yeah, we have the Queen of Pentacles again. So I'm feeling like maybe going back to this X, this person has experienced some sort of tarot moment here. Um, I feel like this person might reach out to you, um, Cancer. 
All right, tell me about the story of wands. Why is the story of wands here? Wow. Three of wands, ten of swords, seven of swords, and the sun here. Tell me about this Eight of Cups. All right, we have the Six of Swords. All right, tell me about this Magician. We have the Eight of Swords here. Tell me about this Ten of Cups. We have the Empress here, again. So this person, this younger individual went back to an ex, started something with an ex, now things are not working out with the sex, and now they're trying to manifest this Empress back. Tell me about the Ten of Wands. We have the Strength card, Leo Energy. Tell me about the Eight of Wands. The Two of Pentacles. I mean, we have someone who's unsure about communicating here. I mean, someone definitely wants to give this another chance here. I feel like someone here is gonna communicate wanting to get back together here. I mean, someone here is still very passionate about this Empress. I mean, someone here is going through a major, 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 major tarot moment. Someone messed up. Someone made a bad decision. Someone made a bad judgment call here. Yeah. Someone made a bad judgment call. I mean, I feel like someone's kicking themselves in the head for doing this. I'm feeling like someone's realizing maybe there's no chance of recovering this. I mean, someone moved on. I feel like this Empress might be in another relationship. Yeah, someone moved on. And I feel like this, this younger individual might not be happy about that. Yeah, someone moved on. Someone's coming back around. An ex, someone here went back with, went back with an ex, it didn't work out, now someone's coming back. So Cancer, this is your general reading. What karma are they currently facing? If this resonated, uh, please uh, give this video a thumbs up. Uh, obviously, you can't comment, uh, but feel free to pop me a DM on my Instagram uh, handle. Uh, share this video if you uh, feel like there is someone that needs to hear this. And subscribe to my channel and ring the notification bell, and I'll speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks.